All right. So I put my headphones in. Hopefully people will be able to hear me now. I found it like I, I was live streaming for a good 20 minutes and then someone finally like someone told me they couldn't hear me. So I I put in headphones, my Bluetooth. So maybe like maybe that's just it, the mic that needs to be picked up. Hopefully that was the issue. I'm gonna turn my music back on. Let me see. Let's see how this works out. And even so, I'll post this out the way, whether someone joins or not. The other video, because there's no audio, I'm probably not gonna post, but update on what happened. I painted this so far. I had already done the back with the flames. I had just done the white goose, as well as touching up the flames around it. So other than that, I didn't really paint much. That was going up about how I wanted to live stream more and how much I'm enjoying doing this, just painting and relaxing with you guys. Whoever does watch this. But let's continue. I have to finish painting the white goose. I need the well from here it might look nice. There's a lot of like touchy spots where it's like you can see the background, you can see the black through it. And I'm trying to make it sure it's more solid and flat. It shows like the worst time to live stream, like Wednesday afternoon, like at 1 p.m. You know, I mean, people are probably still in school right now. But then I'd be college, high school. I really hope there's not no schoolers on here. <laughs> Although it's not like I'm doing anything bad, I'm just painting a goose. But still. Every middle schooler I've talked to the past two years have been interesting. Who knows? I uh, need to be like, how it up. Yes, go. Now that I said all those things earlier in the previous last room, I don't even know what to say now. Only because I'm afraid of what the audio is going to do again. Because man, what if the audio is just not there again? That'd stink. Normally I wouldn't, but yeah. Okay, that's 
and what push little thing here, and that'll be good for the white for now. Good dump this in my bucket water. I'm gonna grab another brush and let's start working the beak. Um, I have cuphead music playing. Nice. I'm trying to keep myself focused in camera. Or at least, you know, on camera. You know, I made a mention earlier, like on the previous uh, previous time, I was thinking about pointing a reference photo of the goose. This is supposed to be the goose from Untitled Goose Game. You know, just a plain white goose, no details, no nothing. Just a simple, plain white goose. And it's like, you know, from memory, I've been doing pretty good, but now I'm thinking about it. Should I just like leave it here? Or do I bring it up more? I think, I think there is a bit more of like the middle of the body. Or middle of the head, really. Hmm. There we go. Yes, I'm not listening to end credits because I just don't feel like listening to that right now. There we go. Ooh, that looks good. I think that looks really nice. Make sure the orange is nice and layered on there. A nice watch. That looks nice. Actually, like really, I like it. Now we're just gonna start the white because I would do the black eyes, but I need to paint on the white for that. So make sure I go all the white though, first, you know. Ah, <laughs> tee uh, I mean. All I really need to do is make sure the lines on the outline is smooth. That's all I need to do left. And now I'm gonna grab a small brush into the eyes. I feel like it just looks like normal. The goose just has like dot eyes, nothing really big. Okay. 
it. I'm gonna uh, Google real quick a Nantella Goosey. Just to look at the ghost real quick. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it is a bit, uh... Man, I sh So I was right about the... I was kind of excited about the beak. There's a lot of things I want to fix on it now that I'm looking at it. I also should have brought this back more and helped this down. But that's a lesson to learn, you know? Maybe I can just throw a little bit of black in here and fix it up. And it seems to come up more. The reference is going to change everything. Ooh, Soda City Funk. That's a good song. It's the big issue. Oh, we're pretty much good. We just need to dot the eyes in. Maybe like a red dot in the middle of the eyes, be like, you know, the lust for arson or something like that. But I like it. Oh, yes, and I can't forget the one thing that I wanted to do that's super important. Um, I will do the red dot in the middle because it's arson. Maybe we'll do a little, a little flame in his eye. What I want to do, where is it? Um, 
Okay, I don't have it out, so let me grab it real quick. I wanted to write honk a bunch of times around him in silver. The cleanest penmanship I could possibly do because I have horrible penmanship. Honk. One last honk for good measures. Try to be careful not to touch the canvas because I don't want paint getting everywhere on me. Up honk, please, the last honk. Honk, honk, honk. The last honk looks horrible. I'm gonna fix that real quick. <laughs> it looks really weird next to the other ones. If I messed up the K, put it too close to the end. Okay, that looks in so much better. And then we're just gonna put some little action lines right here. Quick one, two. I'm just gonna put one more honk in while it's way down here. Cinematic decisions. Honk, honk, honk. I don't want to put one more fionk, like a fionk song, in here.
Oh, that looks amazing, actually. I love it. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Ta-da! Honk, 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 honk. <laughs> that sounds dumb. I love it. I'm just gonna quickly touch up the bottom half of it, so this way I know the edges. And then I'm gonna end this live stream for today. I might do this again. Paint some more. I wanna do this more often with you guys. If people start joining more. There we go, that looks better. And now, oh, before I forget, I gotta sign it. I almost forgot. I'm gonna check to see if this did have audio at the end of it after I pause this. Or like end it. <laughs> Until my like night stream. I'm probably gonna do stuff on Twitch as well to do like digital art as well as I played Pixel Painter the other day. Which was fun because I get the draws and stuff. It you know, gives me random prompts. Which is fun and interesting. Helps you get ideas flowing. So I will probably set out like a story again to let you guys know next time I'm live streaming. Uh, so, until next time.